broadcast or it doesn't really matter. Alright, so we are back here in Skyrim. Oh, and I should change the stream title to something that isn't Bruma Adventures. Can I do that? Hey, you know what? We'll, we'll figure it out later. We don't really need to... Uh, don't really need to update it, I guess, right now. So, we are back in Skyrim. We're doing funny Skyrim things. Last time, Nelly finally got fed up with everything going on down there with the Thalmor and all that shit going down in Bruma. So she decided to move up north to the southernmost hold of Skyrim, and that is Falkreath. And while she was here, she was uh, assailed a little bit by... Um, uh, by a few Daedric princes, uh, such as Meridia and Hercene. She's actually got the Savior's Hide right now, which is one of the rewards you could get from Hercene. Um, oh, yeah, she got a free horse. She got a, le a letter from uh, House Tilvani, a man named Neloth, who's a very renowned member of House Tilvani, telling her to build a fucking mushroom house over here on Lake Illinalta, so that's also something she's been working on. But also, uh, while she's uh, just been here moseying about, she's realized that um, one of her legend, or one of her letters, I'm sorry, yes, this right here, this is located, oh, it's all the way up there? Okay, I thought it was in British and Pass. I thought the staff of Hasidoki was closer. Never mind, but that is something to look into um, for the future, is that one of... Uh, a, a magical artifact, um, very powerful one, is supposedly uh, somewhere up around there that she's got to look into. So, she's also, she's got to collect white caps, which are an alchemical ingredient that she'll need for, uh, um, I was thinking about something. She will need it uh, to build the uh, bridge over to Telnalta, so she can start growing that mushroom citadel over there. That's pretty much what we're going to be working on now, mostly. Um, however, we do want to get this uh, matter with the... Uh... Hold on. Where the fuck is it? Oh god, oh god, there's some... The dog. Yes, she wants to find the dog outside of Falkyrie. Oh, and it's just right there. Okay, I was going to get clairvoyance and everything, and the dog was right fucking there. Hold on. All right, come here, little you boy. Are exactly what I was looking for. That was unexpected. I feel like Nelly. <laughs> Nelly just be like, "Yeah, okay, that's a talking dog." So you're looking for me? What's what's going on? I feel like that Nelly's reaction very similar to yeah, this. Yeah, I think it'll be just what I need. You see, my name is Bobbis. And I have a problem I think you can help sort out. What could a dog need help with? You know, I, I helped one dog that actually looked quite a lot like you. Uh, I helped get him back to his abusive owner, so I hope that's what I'm doing here. My master and I had a, a bit of a falling out. We got oh, into yes, thank God I'm doing it again. Heated. He's kicking me out until I find someone who can settle our disagreement. That's where you come in. Wait, 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 wait. You're very funny. <laughs> yeah. My master's clavicus vile. <laughs> Daedric prince of wishes. As you can imagine, he's quite the important person. I feel like uh, right about then, Nelly was beginning to realize that the name Barbus. Uh, it sounded very familiar, because she knows a lot about the Daedra. Um, specifically, I feel like, you know, Clavicus Vile and Barbus are somewhat important to the history of Morrowind, because they did try to kill Vivek once. That's a plotline in ESO. It's actually one of the better DLCs, the Morrowind one. Thank you! Now, since he banished me, Vile's been rather weak. He can't manage Also, spoiler alert, because that's a plot twist. <laughs> I know there's a cult that worships him at Hamar's Shane. We should be able to talk to him there. If this works out, I'll make sure you're rewarded. 
And just don't trust any offer he makes you, okay? Understood. Uh, Clavicus Vile is like a, a business contractor. I'm not trusting a goddamn thing. Hold on, let me get on my horse. I don't walk anymore. Not ever since I got this burly, smelly beast. The stilt striders up in Morrowind are much better, let me tell you, but I guess this will do while we're down here in Skyrim. Okay, this is a very, uh, very interesting path you've taken, Barbus. Yeah? Well, that was completely unnecessary. I can't help but feel that my city overhaul mod is completely fucking with Barbus. <laughs> and his pathing. Alrighty. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's just zooming around the place. Come on, goats, get out of the way. I've got a Daedric Prince to go and meet. This is my second. Two days, two Daedric Princes. That's how Skyrim has gone so far. That's entirely fucking wacky. And if you really want to count Namira, you did technically meet her down in uh down in Bruma. You met her cultists, not her specifically. Don't like Namira too much. She just eats people. It's kind of wacky, actually. It's not something I really uh, condone. Being a dark elf and liking my ancestors and all. Eating eating people sort of sort of off the uh, off the table for me. <laughs> Get it. Because they don't eat them. They're not on the table. I should really stop talking. I should make this a, uh, a voiceless Skyrim Let's Play. <laughs> and as I said that, I was checking to make sure my mic wasn't muted. Hold on, I'll be right back. Alrighty, and I'm back, and Barbus is perfectly <laughs> Oh. Something's happened. Oh, that's a fucking cauldron. Okay. Oh shit! Oh, there's rocks. What the fuck just happened? Why was there a cauldron there? That was I, out of all the objects that could have been there. That was just about the most. Oh shit! Oh, Barbus, you're gonna fucking die. Oh, this horse needs to get involved, too. This is just gonna be like my last. Oh, okay. I calmed him down. My last horse also died to, like, a, a troll or something. I actually can't remember. No, it died to fall damage. Never mind. I killed my last horse. <laughs> I made it commit suicide. Whispers. Oh, hey, there's a standing stone up north. I really sort of want to discover that standing stone, but maybe we'll do it later. Do we have a new quest for this yet? Or is it just... Oh, okay. Alright, these elk are a little wacky. I don't quite like them. Is that Helgen right there? Ooh, ooh, that's totally fucking Helgen. Oh, shit. I hope... Oh, I hope we don't go close enough to trigger the fucking thing, because then Nelly would totally investigate that, and we'd throw off my entire plan of not doing the main quest for five years. Oh, we're going right through Helgen as well. My game just crashed. It's alright. It's completely fine.
Alrighty. Second time's a charm. <laughs> I'd also very much like to know why my broadcast bar is not showing up in the top right. That is very interesting. And something I should probably be more concerned about. But I know that the stream's actually running because I have it pulled up on my phone to watch chat. I just had a big cup of coffee and it was the best thing ever. Hey, there's our Argonian friend again. We get this dude a lot. This guy in the welcomed stone, we get a lot. here. Well, we're just gonna really quick speed run exactly what just happened. Where is my horse? Oh shit. Oh, there he is. Okay. There are a lot of just random ass dogs around uh, Falkreath, aren't there? Probably should remember to save this time. Hey, actually, we're, we're getting straight to the chase this time. We're not going through Falkreath. I didn't even notice that until right now. I don't know, what do these guys want? They look like traveling salesmen. You know what? We're not going to deal with it. We're not going to deal with it specifically because I have to cut this part out of the YouTube video. So the people aren't going to know that we ran into the uh, Alakir warriors just now. To the rocks again. They're gonna send down rocks. Oh, and a cauldron. They send down rocks and a cauldron. Okay, that makes more sense. There's a troll. fuck is that? Okay, never mind. No one I care about. No one I care about. Oh god. That rain's pretty loud. Hey, 
It wasn't raining the last time we were up here, I don't think. That's a little wacky. Oh well. YouTube will just have to deal with that. Ah, oh, shit. Yep, there's the dragon. Alright, well... I guess we're gonna have to investigate a dragon. I completed what the hell's unbound. What the fuck did I just complete? What? Oh god. What did I just complete? Oh no. Shit, we've gotta fucking invest- We heard something. We didn't hear a dragon. We just heard something fucking roar. Alright? Doesn't mean it was a dragon, per se. Oh. Horse isn't gonna fit in here. Shit! Horse isn't gonna fit in here. We're gonna have to leave it outside of Helgen. Alright. Wait up, dog. Bangy fucking mutt. He opened that door? He did. He totally opened that door. Alrighty. Yep. So, basically what just happened was we triggered the Live, Al Live Another Life event. Which basically means when you have the alternate start mod installed, you obviously have an alternate start, but when you travel to Helgen, it triggers the Alduin attack and... You see him, usually you see him fly away, but obviously we were on the other side of Helgen, and we couldn't see that. And then you have to go to the caves and investigate, you gotta save one of the dudes. It's a healing potion or whatever. And then, pretty much the main quest goes on as anticipated. See, what's unfortunate about that is I had not anticipated to do the main quest for at least, I don't know, a couple months of playing the game. Uh, but that, that plan sort of flew out the window. So I guess we'll be doing a little bit of the main quest sometime soon. So it's not a priority per se. It's just something we heard that we might want to investigate. Jesus. I do not like the sound of lightning, by the way. Hey, did it just stop raining? Oh, that's pretty cool. The game knew that I didn't like lightning. to sneeze there. Yeah, Barbus, let's go. Back to the very, very, uh, view obscuring snow here. I don't like it. It actually looks very fucking beautiful. Neymar's shame. We've made it, finally. Where'd he go? The fuck did Barbus? He just disappeared. Holy shit. It's a magic dog. Just check out the situation here. Oh. 
there's a person. You know what? We're gonna use mind vision. I fucking love mind vision. Doesn't look like there's anyone else in here. Okay, there's the person. It hates my guts. Yeah. Just wanna check your check your setup, dude. Check your gaming setup up here. See that's why you always check their gaming setups. Pressure plate. Just bad, but still hungry. Blood. All I can think about these days. You know, maybe those Dawn Guard people were right about vampires being a problem. recognized I was here. Yo, holy fuck, she just sent a lot of things at me. Oh god, oh this one's coming. sucked right now. Does not feel too good. Are you killing her? Okay, let me let me jump in on this. Take her out. Go 
Oh god, she's turned invisible. There she is. Wait, let her go up the stairs. Really wasn't expecting you to get too far. Not gonna lie. That wasn't part of the plan. I'm just gonna have them fight while I snuck past, but then they realized I was here. And that's when things got a little nice. There's a woodcutter's axe, we might need that for fire. Books, books. I think we need that. Hey look, an alchemy lab where I can mix up random ingredients. Let's just go to ingredients. We discovered a few new things. Oh shit! Someone snuck up behind me. Holy fuck, how did I let that happen? I heard those footsteps way too late. Oh god, it's still there. Vampires aren't really holding back. In all fairness, I should invest in more health. Wait, hold on. It's Fury. Why does it always do that? Stop. Get. Okay, I'm stuck. I am so stuck. I'm feeling my clan feels about to- oh, no. She's alerted everyone else.
fighting. Oh, they're fighting. Why? Fucking heard me. I can get out of here right now. Okay. Ooh, that animal. It's a giant fucking spider right there. You go do it with the spider. Go with the fucking obliterate spider. need to get a new summon. I've said that a lot, but it's really true. Okay, there's an arcane enchanter here. What can I disenchant? Oh, next is the water breathing. I'm going to need to do that. Oh look, they're already fighting. What are they all fighting? Oh, they're all fighting barbers. Master Vampire, why are we not there? Okay. You're killing the one that's friends with me. 
I see how it is. Oh, I just picked up vampire boots. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, okay. Oh, should, should just make your offering, then I guess I'll take that. Alright, 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 alright. That's it. We're about done with you, sir. Okay, that's a big fucking sword. That is a big sword. Never mind. I said I was about done with you. I meant actually, I meant uh, I'm really cool friends with you, and I want to. Just kidding. I come back to kill you. Fuck yeah. Dwarven sword on him. Do you not have any epic loot on you, my man? Right. We're just gonna have to kill this one. Take him. Alright, alright, you bastard. By all means, let's hear it. It's the least I could do since you already helped me grant one final wish for my last worshippers. They were suffering so from vampirism and begged me for a cure. Then you came and ended their misery. I couldn't have planned it better myself. So, what's your heart's desire? What kind of deal can we strike? Reunite you with Barbus, that's uh, what I want to do. That insufferable pup! Forget it! Request denied! No deal! I'm glad to be rid of him. Even if it does mean I'm stuck in this pitiful shrine in the back end of nowhere. Well, perhaps there is a way he could earn his place back at my side. Maybe. No promises. What's your There's offer? an axe. An incredibly powerful axe. An axe powerful Shut enough for up. me to have I hate that fucking vampire. It sounds so loud. I don't Bring it, it to me. Lot, I'll grant so you my boon. No strings attached. No messy surprises. At least not for you. As I recall, it's resting in Brine Rock Burrow. Barbers can lead you right to it. Little Mutt might even add his place back at my side. Um. Improved conjuration spells and can make pacts. That sounds really fucking cool. Um, break or ignore new facts. No, I'm not gonna follow Clavicus though. Not over Azura, but that does look like I would like to make a uh, Clavicus vile worshiper character someday. That actually sounds really cool. He's one of my. Uh, this is one of my favorite, uh... Daedra. What's the story behind the one Rufal of Axe? One is his little Jess. A wizard named Sebastian Lord had a daughter who worshipped her scene. Yeah, When the daughter there, became a werewolf, it drove Sebastian over the edge. It couldn't stand oh to God, see his little girl take here. on such a beautiful form. The wizard wished for the ability to end his daughter's curse. <laughs> Clavicus gave him an axe. <laughs> How funny. Alright, it's almost 10 p.m. It's almost time to camp. Improves many boons received by followers of elven deities by 10%. And I'll take it, I'm not gonna use it though. And there's those coming back to haunt me. Alrighty.
I need to set up a campfire with a little tent. Uh, let's just do it like right, like right here. Powers, resourcefulness. Build a campfire. Place it right here. Use the campfire. Shit, I need to uh, scavenge for fucking wood. Chop dead wood. Three pieces of dead wood, what can I do with that? Kindling, alright. Add one more kindling. Well, this is good quality tin kindling. Fire magic. What time is it? Alright, it's already 11 p.m. I think we'll sleep then. Where's our... Oh, there we go. Uh, let's place it... Right there? Where is it? Hold on. Starting, starting to come together. Oh, how cozy. What a cozy little. Wait, wait, wait. Can we. Wait, wait, wait. Can we turn on the light? Oh, we can. That's great. Sleep for. Six hours. Gotta be up to pray at uh, 5 a.m. for Azura. I'm gonna pack this shit up. And we're gonna pray to Azura. Favor with Azura is 126%. That is excellent. That's, uh, that's exactly the quota I wanted to hit. Okay. Oh. Rhyme Rock, Rhyme Rock Barrel. Wow. Isn't that a, just an interesting little place. All the way up there. Alrighty. Looks like we'll have to catch a ride back in Valkyrie. Oh no, why? Why did it go all the way down to mods? Now it's gonna spend the next half hour loading my mods. Fuck! Why is this thing so fast sometimes? I expected to go down to like a fucking save or load and it shoots down to mods and I'm like, well shit. What am I supposed to do now? I wish there was a way to back out, out of it in this happening but obviously there's not which is very upsetting
So how's your how's your day going, guys? How about that weather? How about that weather? No. Oh. I'm to save. Thank you. We're gonna go out this way. Oh god, it's so dark. I forgot that I used candlelight. Hey there. Are you just a hunter? Alright. Good talk. It's the Stormcloak camp down here. Oh my god, I can barely see anything. Okay, there's a there's a place up here. Alright. Alright, back onto the beaten path. Let's go. And there's another lamppost, dude. These things are guiding me. Okay, and the snow simmered down. Well, we'll investigate Helgen eventually. I just don't want to fucking piss off Clavic's file. I'd be really mean and naughty. So we can jump past these ruins here. Yeah. God, what the fuck happened to this place? I've just now realized this place is in ruins. Looks like a fucking meteorite struck it. This must have been what Vivek, look, Vivek looked like after it was destroyed. Talking about the city, not the person. Alrighty, Enrique's here waiting for me. So that's good. My horse didn't die while I left her. I'm assuming it's a her because Rika sounds like a very female name. I, I, I suppose Nelly doesn't really know what the horse is named. Because there's no way she would know that. Maybe she found a name tag on the horse. Nope, that is not the button that I meant to push. That's not at all the button that I meant to push. I'm gonna go figure out what's up here. It's kinda nice out here. Oh shit, okay, we'll need to, um, actually restart the game. We'll make it one episode. Uh, I'm not gonna go into the details on what just happened, uh, for YouTube, because, um, it's been about one, two, it's been about three days since I recorded that, uh, that little segment there at the beginning. Um... Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, 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 you can check it out on Instagram, I'm pretty sure I explained it, like some other places, so I'm just, I'm not gonna bother going into that, uh, we're just gonna continue like it's normal, like it's just been one episode, not draw any more attention to it. Uh, we just arrived here at the Guardian Stones, and I picked the Mage one, obviously. Um, we also have Andromeda, which means all the Guardian Stones are much more unique than they were, except for these three, these guardian- I mean, these are the guardian stones. Andromeda changes every standing stone. Um, yeah, those three specifically are called the guardian stones. Anyway, uh, that's right. We need to make our way up to fucking... Rimrock Barrow. So, we're going to go over to the stables by Falkreath. here. 
Alright, is it a wolf? The wolf, I'm just gonna fuck off on us, the troll. Alright, hold on. Hold on a second. Right here. Uh, oh, this guy here. Yeah. Oh, I see. I see attacking. Oh, I don't want him to die. Hello there, fellow traveler. One itinerant minstrel and wandering wastrel at your service. Yeah, this guy's just a ah, traveling well, fucking bard. After a little incident with a roguish lad and uh, the daughter of a prominent thane, well, let's just say there's not. Afraid not. But if you're serious about sharpening that tongue, you might try the bard's college in solitude. Good day. Love that, which is always nice to have. Let's examine what we've come across here. This is the Shrine to Talos. Any dead worshippers I see. Do I have any? I'm not accepting Talos, obviously. Something to accept, um... Some epic blessings in case I was infected by anything. We got funny Thalmor orders. How cool. How wacky. Let's take a look at those. I hate the Thalmor. I'm glad that at least one of them died here. We don't take kindly to the Thalmor doing this sort of shit. In response to your report dated 22nd Morningstar 401, your request for an expeditionary force is hereby denied. Sanyon, this is the seventh report you've filed this month, and not one of your leads, not one, has turned in so much as a shred of evidence that a Talos Shrine exists in the, na in the Lake Illinalta reason. No prisoners, no documents, nothing. Our forces are stretched thin enough as it, as it is, and I have better missions, better agents to assign them to. If you feel so sure of your informant, investigate this yourself. Come back with proof, or not at all. I'm a hand and seal, Ellenwyn. Ellenwyn, Ambassador Ellenwyn, is the, uh, Thalmor, uh, sort of leader, I guess, here in, um, here in Skyrim. Really quick. Check that my atmospheric conditions are the same. They should be, but you never know with Skyrim. Yeah, no, they didn't change at all. Okay. We need some more white caps so that we can start growing that mushroom tower. We've got a wolf. Oh, we've got three of them. And notice they're not attacking instantly because we've got divine wolves installed, which makes wolves a lot less annoying. But apparently it only affects the ones in Skyrim. Uh, it does not apply to all wolves in game, or else Cyrodiil would have been a lot easier. Attacking me. Off to the right there. What are those? Are those bandits? They look like bandits. Let's conjure a clan fear over there. Oh, fucking Rikor is running her ass in there. Yeah, some bandits. the fucking horse. I'll oh, command this here. Why 
Why the fuck are you attacking the one that's commanded? Jesus. Why are they- why are they attacking this one? Not even a problem. that guy. Imagine not picking up everything and being constantly encumbered. Bro, that's usually me when I'm playing fucking uh, games, but I've tried to tone it down recently. Because I noticed when I was playing Fallout New Vegas, I was picking up so much shit. And I just couldn't move anywhere. Pretty sure being over encumbered in New Vegas uh, makes you completely immobile. Or there's a point where if you have so much over, then it makes you immobile. That's why I finally decided I need to break the addiction to just grab everything. Hello there. You guys want to talk to me at all? Is this a, is a dude man? I'm on my way to solitude to join the Legion. A united empire is better for everyone. I would I would have thought better of a fellow dark elf. Oh god, that's where the spriggan is. Let's hope that we don't trigger her. Okay, I don't think we did. That's good. Fucking spriggans are annoying. Be coming up on the Falkreath cart here in a second. I think it's just over that left. Yeah. I think the place that's closest is Haragstead or something like that. Uh, Haragstead Waste Station. All right. Need a ride? Where do you want to go? Um, let's go. I guess solitude would be Climb the closest. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Yeah. So maybe I guess we can't First travel. First time to solitude. Beautiful old city, capital of Skyrim, but I'm sure you're. Is solitude the capital? I thought that it changes depending on who the High King is. And right now the capital would probably be Windhelm then. Because I think Ulfric is the High King. I think? He, technically he's the High King? Yeah. Yeah. Hey there, Barbus. How's it going? Oh god, it's fucking 12 a.m. Probably sleep somewhere then. Is my horse here? Yep. Is there an inn here, or is this just no? I'm assuming it's not like a little station that we can stop by. Oh god, there's a statue to Meridia up there as well. We could quite potentially be doing a lot of things here. Yeah, if that's the case, then I think it's best to just, uh... Find, uh, find shelter up here in solitude. Is this, who's this fellow? You're passing through solitude? Maybe you're looking to make some easy gold, yes? 
That depends. It's easy to find things to sell. Things nobody will miss. Things from underground, or just left lying around in someone's house. I bet the two of us, we're very alike. So why not take the next step? We can help each other. My sister Deja and I are treasure hunters. We like to collect things. Is that Deja? Or... Of course not. Thieves take what is precious. Thieves steal. We just take what will not be missed. What no one needs anymore. Maybe we take some weapons and stop a few deaths. Who would call that thievery? Clever one. With the war, many more ships come through these docks, loaded with weapons and pay, but few people, and they pass through dangerous waters. We have an interest in one of those boats, the Ice Runner. The Solitude Lighthouse will be guiding it in, but if its fire were to go out, the Ice Runner would run aground. Right. What an interesting idea. I think if someone were to do something like that, there would definitely be a certain amount of loot to be shared. Yes, if someone were to put out the lighthouse fire and then meet me on the docks afterwards, I could certainly direct them to that loot. Turn me in? For what? What crime's been committed? I'm just making idle talk about what would most undoubtedly be a tragic event. A tragic and very, very profitable event. Don't worry about them. We'll make sure they wash up safe. Maybe they'll even pay us for their heroic rescue from their sad crash. I don't know, I don't think I'm too interested in the... completed your task. I don't think Nelly's too interested in working with some Argonian thugs trying to get paid. Do you not actually discover solitude until you like go inside? Like any city for that matter? I wonder. Well, we're gonna look for some lodging up in here. Okay, now I discovered it, yeah. Tell them he didn't do it. Positions. As far as you need to go home. Go home Traitor. and stay there until your mother. You betrayed us. Lock the city gate. You should tell me that I stop and betray his high king. Best she know now. All right. Rock there. You helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Tori. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Sodom. He doesn't deserve to speak! Murder! Stop! You beat the High King in fair combat! Well, this is interesting. Um, it's raining though, so I'm just gonna go inside. Uh, I don't much care. For <laughs> a public execution at midnight. <laughs> I don't think uh, in the rain, especially Nelly's not too interested in something like that. Come on in. Let me know if you need anything, or take a seat by the fire, and I'll send someone over. All right, you, that disembodied voice. Where the fuck did you come from? I care. Where'd that disembodied voice come from? Either Barbus. <laughs> I 
Um, is there like a bartender or anyone around here that could I think I expect more. rent me a room? You? Oh, I guess it's all over. I expected... Oh, I don't know what I expected. You? Brilliant! Yeah, okay. Sure I thing. Room. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Harvest, get out of the fucking way. Welcome to the Winking Ski River. The... Are you joking? You just rented a room for me. I need anything, you just say the word. Huh. Where's the room at? You know what, I think I'll take my chances on finding the room. Is it this one? Yay. <laughs> Only sleeping for three hours. I need to. I don't really need to pray anymore. I Let me know if there's anything else you need. But Elliot still do it. Alrighty. Yeah, it's still storming outside as well. No, I can't take those. Speak quickly. Been an interesting to talk to around here. Visitor, citizen, citizen visitor. Yes. I guess not really. Ready. Not a very talkative place. Solitude. <laughs> I suppose it got its name from something. God, it's still fucking raining. Let's just try and go around and. Oh, okay, no one's gonna be open. Let's just wait around for two hours then. Things hopefully brighten up. Citizen, until next time. Hopefully, this place looks like an alchemy place, so hopefully she sells white cap. Feel free to look around. We have a fine selection of herbs here at Angela's Aromatics. You're a right, traveler, Angeline. correct? Have you been to White Run? I have not been to White Run before. Oh well, it was a long shot. Take a look. Hmm. Ingredients. I need some white cap from you. No white cap. Damn. I could probably sell some stuff to you that I don't need. Anything stamina, I guess I don't really need. Why do I have so much fucking... Uh, I have so many, I have so much gold, I keep forgetting. Yeah, no, I don't think I'm really interested in selling anything. Don't Sorry. forget me next time you, you were there for Rogvir's execution. Most people head over to the Winking Skeever. If you're not interested in music or drink, you can at least talk to Corpulus. He can fill you in on any of the latest gossip. Corpulus. Perhaps, but necessary. My cousin Fura is somewhere out there in Skyrim right now, fighting Ulfric Stormcloak and his damns insurrectionists. She wouldn't have to be there at all if it weren't for Rogvir. And my aunt wouldn't have to worry about her daughter. Why are they executing Rogvir, my man? Hey, it's alright, Ash. Welcome back. You really don't know? He lets Ulfric Stormcloak escape solitude. 
Ulfric rides in, murders the High King, and Rogvir lets him ride right back out. How interesting. People to see oh, him places she to is go, teleported. Huh? Later then. She's mastered some arcane magic. Okay. It's still raining. Still raining very heavily. Some pieces. I can harvest to my heart's content here. Fishing. Gone fishing. Let's go here then. Let's see. Let's see what he's got. Maybe he's got some spells, some wacky magic to sell to us. Welcome to bits and pieces. Oh, she. I'm sure you'll find what you need here. Biren said you got here just before the execution. Must have been a lovely first sight. Who's Biren? Baron's my husband. Or he works Baron. in the forge up at Castle Dower. I barely see him nowadays. What with him filling orders for the army. No, that was an ugly affair. High King Torig's death has turned the whole town on its head. Between you and me, he wasn't even that good a king. All of those rambling speeches about the Empire this and the Empire that. All right. Some might call this junk. Me? Me, I call them I call treasures. Them treasures. Oh. Nothing. Actually, what? Uh, biography of Baron Zaya. I need to see. We don't have volume three. Alright, we're gonna take that. I can sell to you. I don't wanna sell that because the flame light spear or spire is actually fucking badass. God, homebrew lore write ups are a mistake, man. That's why I just stick to the official shit. My brain isn't powerful enough to think about homebrew settings. Fit the brand. We got that from Bruma though, so we're gonna we're gonna keep that. It would cut his axe for cutting wood. No. We need that. And my speech has increased. Yay. Oh I can enchant gloves. That'd be a good idea. I don't really need this Lantern of the Ancestors. Trinkets, okay. odds and ends, that sort of thing. What? what else do you got? I don't think that's gonna be... Okay, there's some backpacks in here. Um... I think we already have enough of it. Necklace of Tremors? Is that a Tremors reference? Holy shit. Sword's health. Oh, we could use a ring. Ring of Fortitude. Take 8% less damage from power attacks and bashes. my both of those hmm where's the where'd the trimmer's necklace go okay trimmer's necklace um oh that's not gonna be useful to me at all potions I want to take one of cure disease at least some healing yeah that yeah, sounds good to me very poggers. Hey, do you happen to have white cap on you? No one has white cap. Is there anything here that I don't know first effect about? This room blister wart. Alrighty then. Come back so to we'll get, and pieces anytime. Get to reading on those. You have white cap? Oh shit, Ash. I need some white cap. Really bad. I needed to grow a, a giant shroom. Okay, trust me, I'm not tripping out of my mind. Uh, 
Ah, uh, that's the guy that tried to get me to sink a boat that I'm not gonna do. Uh, I guess I, I, you can't really see the city map. Oh, it's still raining. Still raining pretty hard. Alright, you know what? I think we're just gonna get out of here, Barbus. Let's just go and do the thing already. We can do Meridia's thing while we're here as well. We got a thing for Meridia and Clavicus Vile. Just as we started traveling, it stopped raining. Good. Is that Meridia's shrine like right there? Probably is. <laughs> Honest to god. I still don't want to do Clavicus Vile's thing first though because Meridia is kind of wacky. She's a bit of a wacky lass. Oh, we should be going up this way anyway. Spider. How how wacky, how cool. Oh shit! Did I just die? You know, I think I just fucking died. Holy shit. Oh, I just got bamboozled right there. I, I just I just got completely destroyed. Holy fuck. I don't even know. I mean I guess you could say why that's Wildcat did that. I, I, I mean, it would make sense, because Wildcat's fucking weird. Holy shit. I just, I just got bodied by that spider. I'm playing on Legendary. Let's see here. Gameplay. Yeah, I'm playing on Legendary. And I have Wildcat installed, which makes combat harder. But, like, it's taken bandits to hits to kill me before. Uh, Wildcat is a mod that overhauls the combat system, and it makes it a lot more difficult. It adds in stuff like uh, timed blocks and like attacks of opportunity and shit like that. It's made by the same guy that does Ordinator and Apocalypse and, you know, all those overhaul mods. I have all of his shit installed right now. Yeah, I was not expecting that little fucking spider to just absolutely body slam me, not gonna lie. That was not really part of the plan right there. Hey there, there he is, there he is. Alrighty, alright, here's what's gonna happen. There we go. Now we're gonna just walk away and act like we've never seen this thing. I still can't believe that it just completely fucked me up. One shot, I was absolutely destroyed. Alrighty. And we've got- Oh, that's the Thalmor Embassy. I thought that was Haragstad. Okay, we don't want to be here. If Nelly sees Thalmor, she goes into a psychotic 
episode and just murders them. Oh god, okay. Alright, we're getting a little risque up in here. Alright, we don't want Rikora to die like our last horse died. Let's get to... Ragstad, huh? Or whatever is up here. It's like a little... Shack. I also don't want to do Meridia's thing just yet. What do we got up here? Ironback hideout. That's for some bandits, I guess. That guy's gonna kill me. Okay. Holy shit. Oh fuck, he's after me? Oh shit. Fuck. I was not expecting that. Okay, and I'm dead. I do. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All righty then. Oh, he f he fell down after me. <laughs> That's great. I thought the chief would have been preoccupied. I don't know what happened there. Why did my horse stop fighting? That might have been what happened. That quite potentially was something that happened. I need you to calm your tits. What the hell, Raycora? Alrighty, this dude's armor should be lowered since he's under the effect of calm, which means I can just go up and do this number. Oh. And then get gold from my, from my ancestor boys. I probably can't kill the bandit chief in one hit still though. That's still likely gonna be a problem. Yeah. Yeah, I got the feeling that bad things might happen. Yeah, we could just fuck off. We could just not even deal with them. Thanks to... Wait, okay, hold on, wait. Why could I not get on horse? All right, all right. Okay. <laughs> A lot of weird things have just occurred. Hey, it's the Argonian dude. He's back. I need a death counter at this point. This is worse than the fucking Walking Dead season four. That stream. All right. Is this guy? Here, I'm gonna sneak up. Behind now. I want to get that dude to fight the bandit chief. What was that? What's happening? He's been killed. You pick. Oh, just as the fucking thing wore off. Alrighty. Now we're just gonna grab what we can. Death counters is how many times you say L. Yes. Ready.
Let's see, I'm pretty sure this is the Lord Stone. Or the Serpent Stone. It's one of the two. It could be the tower, actually, as well. It's either the Lord. No, I'm 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 certain it's not the tower. It's the serpent or the lord. Fucking. The steed. Okay. Or that. <laughs> um, those under the sun of the steed can carry more items, and since the presence of land in the area, when not in combat, they travel much, much faster and have increased stamina regeneration. And you can only have one at a time. No, I already have the mage stone, uh, and that does not sound too appealing to me. Hey, okay. I guess we're going this way. Is that... Yeah, I want to get to Haragstad really quick. How close is... Oh, holy shit. It's still all the way over there. Oh, god damn. I guess we'll just do Meridia's things for, thing first, then. See what this cave's all about first. Let's just discover that. Twelve school cave. Ready. Let's go over here. Okay, this is like a little a little way station. I wasn't expecting it to be this small. Speak. Yes. Need something? Do you have? No, he doesn't. Okay. <laughs> I think you think it might. I don't know why it'd be under misc, but it could very well be. Traveler's pouch. Pouches. Valued at two thousand seventy-one gold. Huh. Um, real quick, I forgot to put on my rings. Alrighty, it only shows that I have one ring on, but I do indeed have three three rings equipped right now. Alrighty, it's time to Look do the fun. Look at my temple lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals, their crafts and their hearts. If they love me not, how can my love reach them? Restore to me my beacon. That I might guide you toward your destiny. Alrighty. Oh, I'm in. Wait, okay. There we go. Oh, we're flying. I forgot about this, actually. I forgot that you go all the way up into the fucking air. It is time for my splendor to return to Skyrim. But the token of my truth lies buried in the ruins of my once great temple. That's actually a really now nice shot. By a oh, this Castle Volkahar. The necromancer Malkarin defiles my shrine with vile corruptions. Trapping lost souls left in the wake of this war to do his bidding. Worse still, he uses the power stored within my own token to fuel his foul deeds. I have brought you here, mortal, to be my champion. You will enter my temple, retrieve my artifact, and destroy the defiler. 
Um. Mortals call it Dawnbreaker, for it was forged in a holy light that breaks. Yes, that castle is the vampire place. Burning away corruption and false life. You will enter my shrine, destroy Malcarin, and retrieve this mighty blade. I actually don't know if you can go to Castle Volcahar in the base game, or like even see it. I should look that up. Of course you will. I have commanded it. Go now. The artifact must be reclaimed and Malcarin destroyed. Malcarin has forced the door shut, but this is my temple and it responds to my decree. I will send down a ray of light, guide this light through my temple, and its doors will open. Oh, hey, the Meridian, how's it going? Whee! Follow Meridia. Let's see what she get. Uh, improved shit against undead. Slay the undead, never summon the undead. High elves and those skilled in restoration are most deserving of my favor. Uh, if I don't, yeah, no, I don't think I don't think we're choosing Meridia anytime soon. I had Meridia's light through. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll take that. Oh, hey, it's the closed helm, uh, Imperial helmet. I thought that these things were very rare. I guess this might be one of the few locations where you can find one. Anyway, no, it's not interested in that at all. And there's a storm cloak. I do like the closed helm, uh, Imperial helmet much more than the open one, or the closed visor, I should say. It's probably an easier way of saying that. It looks a lot more uh, Roman, sort of, sort of closer to those roots. Although I miss the uh, Imperial Guards from Oblivion. Their armor was really cool. Latch crack time. <laughs> that accomplish? I heard some spikes going up, but I don't know where from. I guess it was just back here. Owned ancient Nordic sword. Not too interested in that. Ebony bow? Just fucking sit in here? Well, damn. Oh right, I forgot these uh, silly little puzzles in the Kilkreath Temple. I'm pretty sure these get rather annoying as time goes on. If I recall correctly at least. I like how we just have Barbas following us around. Just casually, we have half a Daedric Prince here with us. No, no, stop. Stop going to me. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Fight each other.
God, I have way too many spells in my favorites. Bounce for a bit. Um, I'm gonna leave my on the stream. Alrighty. Uh, see you later then. Ash. I'm gonna sneakily kill whoever survives this encounter. Fun. This is a fun little uh, little area. It gets memed on a lot because Meridia in general gets memed on for the role she played in Skyrim and the beacon and all that. is someone who's relentlessly memed on um, for Skyrim. Right, I'm supposed to eventually connect these somehow. But I don't think I do that right now. Oh yeah, I leveled up. Let's go in health for, uh, for a change. Did get another perk point. It's three undead skeevers under your control. Oh yeah, no, I don't. I don't like Rat King because it's very. It's a very annoying perk. We're getting up there with illusion though. We're getting like, some cool abilities. I guess it's dead. See, it would have been easier if they just made like a ghost model for these things. I don't know why they're based off skeletons. They should have just made a fucking ghost model for Skyrim. It wouldn't have been that hard. Unfortunately, they didn't, and because they didn't, um, they had like Aelid Draugr for uh, Bruma. Because obviously there are no ghosts, so you can't have the cool ghosts that were in Oblivion.
one else in here. I'm, I'm actually, I'll, I will latch crack this. Did that work? Oh, I, th I thought it was adept before. Might actually enchant those rings that I just or disenchant those rings that I just got as well. Just for the sake of having those enchantments. And leveling up enchant, of course. balcony now we're over here we're doing a funny I bet thought those were people for a second ready I always forget that master is higher than expert in Skyrim for some reason. I uh, for some reason I always associated expert with like a higher level of expertise, but I don't know. That's just me, perhaps. Flawed Varla Stone. What? What the fuck is this? Is that an Oblivion thing? I think it is. I might have gotten that from uh, Rare Curios, which is one of the uh, things from Mad God's bundle. This just adds a bunch of rare alchemical ingredients. If so, that's cool. guy there. Don't know where any of the other funny guys are. Oh, there's quite a few of them down here.
slowly trying to get this thing killed. Oh, it'll probably die soon enough. I noticed just at the last second that there was a little fucking wire attached to that door. Who has an empty strong box? Just go down that once. No, 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 no. Oh shit, I'm falling, I'm falling. Fuck. I was trying to do a cool thing with shared trauma. Oh yeah, I'd rather you get attacked by that thing. I was trying to do a cool thing with shared trauma where I was hopefully gonna get. Oh my god, that is just gonna be following us. Barbus kills him, of course. Out of the Red Mountain, taking that. Don't know why that increases block. I suppose I would never. I, I might not have ever read that actually. I've read a lot of books in uh, the Elder Scrolls, but it's been a while since I have, and I've forgotten which ones I did. Shit, they have arrows? Oh fuck, I didn't know that they had arrows. How far back are we? Okay, not too far. Yeah, I wasn't aware that they had arrows.
course Barbus is gonna start fucking on him, as he usually does. What did this accomplish? Did I do something? Oh. Came in from there, I think. Am I supposed to go down here now? Yes. I've unlocked it. Yes, these things get a little insane, as I've said. There's Mr. Man inside of there. If I enrage him, they'll all attack him. using ice spells which is bad the last mage we went against that used fucking ice spells on us just dunked on us relentlessly this guy's almost dead though let's calm him Oh shit, I forgot about that. Forgot about that part. About how he summons a, a shade. Where the fuck the Oh god, he's right there? Oh shit. I'm gonna use my um My Guardians. Where's my guardians? My spirit walk. Ancestors kill him. Yes. It is done. The defiler is defeated. Um, is Take he? Dawn Breaker from its pedestal. It looks like things are still spawning down here. Okay. There's a lot of gold on these fucking corpses. get too rich is the thing. I already think I'm too rich before. Maybe I've got the funny Dawnbreaker. Nuts. I think that's already Meridia's quest done. Thankfully we got that one out of the way. shall remain at rest. This is as it should be. This is because of you. A new day is dawning, and you shall be its herald. Take the mighty Dawnbreaker, and with it purge corruption from the dark corners of the world. Oh, Wield yeah. it in my name. I'm not going to do that at all. But... Oh, yeah. <laughs> it matters not. 
The plant cares nothing for the rays that bring it the warmth of the sun. As you carry Dawnbreaker, so will my light touch the world. Yeah, going back down. All right, All right it's, it's almost seven already. Boy, I thought I heard some Nordic chanting there for a second. Like the kind that you hear when you go to a, uh, when you go to a funny. And gain a shout word. Yeah. Okay, there's the road. I was losing the road there for a second. He's gonna try and run past that thing. Echo Cave. That sounds vaguely familiar, like I've been there before. Maybe it's an important place for a quest. Something is trying to shoot at me. No. I heard this one. I heard like some sort of arrow, fucking knocking into something. Sound. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Okay. Dismount horse before going through door. Alright. I'm gonna take you on the other side actually before I go in here. I'm Rock Burrow. Here we go. God, I am in inexplicably very tired, despite the fact that I just ate. flame out or not. I can sleep in here. Have fun. <laughs> That's a conjuration book. I knew it from the uh, cover. Snow breeze.
I think we've got everything of interest on there. And some Shigorath. So, uh, do not want to follow Shigorath, though. He is one of the um, four corners of the House of Troubles. Which I incorrectly, I don't know if I said this before, I incorrectly called it the four corners of the House of Chaos and the House of Evil in the first episode. But the Evil Daedric Princes are actually called the four corners of the House of Troubles. Uh, in Dunmary culture. I don't know if I ever corrected that. Let's just have that guy be chill with me. Um, yep, I had a feeling that thing was about to explode. Didn't even kill the dude. Didn't even kill him. In and out. All sneaky like. By funny illusion spells. Oh, where'd the horse go? Oh, there it is. Okay. It's too fucking dark. Oh, I was standing on top of the horse there for a second. That's actually a really common thing in ESO. You'll like mount your, uh, you, you'll get on your mount and you'll just be running on top of it instead of, um, instead of like mounting it, really. Trying to get to the f fucking uh, solitude stables now. <laughs> As you can tell, it's very hard to navigate in the dark here. I think I go through this way though. Oh, it stopped snowing. Just in time. I should be able to get there rather easily now. Imperial business. Be on your way. Yep, yep. I don't want to interfere in that. And this is the wrong way. It's the wrong path. Fucking, my horse has been running for a really long time. She's just been going.
Oh shit. Can't pray in combat. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh well. I can wait, but can't pray. What the fuck? Okay. Need a ride? Yes, what are you doing? My carriage is the safest. Need something? I would like to travel, please. Somebody help! Help what? What's happening? I don't even see the spiders around. What? Oh, oh my god, okay, what? What is happening here? What is happening? What's happening? We're cool? Good morning. Yeah, okay. Where do you want to go? I want to go to Falkreath. Climb and back and we'll be off. There once was a hero named Ragnar. Ragnar, Red Red, who tried riding from Old Rorik's Dead. Oh yeah. He was singing the jams, dude. We got the fucking radio Skyrim on. Get a, a room at the dead man's drink real quick before we continue our adventure with Clavicus Vile. Welcome to Dead Man's Drink. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Okay. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. I know where the room is. Don't you worry. Who's attacking? Little fucking spider. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's get going then. On our way back up to Hamar's Shame, right? I think that's the place. I wonder what Hamar has to be so shameful about.
are strange whispers. I hear those all the time now. I wish I could like change the frequency at which they appear, but it appears that I can't. Feels like every couple of minutes now I just run into weird whispers. Trolls are a lot more common than I originally thought. I did not remember trolls being this common. Gotta, gotta tell ya. here as for some reason there's no way through this rubble for a horse so I need to investigate what happened here this is a pretty big fucking mess but I guess we'll figure out in some time That Skyrim is a lot smaller than you'd think. It, it's it's a very small. I'm pretty sure the the world, the game world of Skyrim, is smaller than Oblivion, which makes sense because Skyrim, the province, is smaller than Oblivion. But still, this is Oblivion itself was way too small, and arguably so is Morrowind. The only like two size Elder Scrolls game really was Daggerfall. Daggerfall was roughly the size of London. Not just London, I should say all of England. It was roughly the size of England. And, um... Uh, that was just the Illinalta, Illinalta Bay region, which was just the region connecting Hammer Rock, or Hammer... Hammerfell and High Rock. It was just the region connecting those two. So... And Tamriel is a big place. It's really big. And the game sort of under undermine how big it really is. All except for Daggerfall. It would take 100 days to get from like one side of the... Uh... Did I say Illinalta Bay? I think I might have said Illinalta. Illinalta is the lake in Skyrim. What I meant to say was... Um... What is that place called? The something bay. I think it starts with an I. Fuck. What is the what is that region called? 
Oh, it's actually gonna annoy me. Iliac Bay. It's the Iliac region. Yeah, that's what I meant to say. Um, and oh. that alone is roughly the size of uh, Great Britain. Check out what this Rufal Axe does real quick. I can't actually remember really well. 20 points of stamina damage. It actually sounds really shitty. Stamina damage is like the worst type of damage to do. Alrighty, clavy clavy. Ah, you've got the axe! And my dog! Splendid! Yeah, yeah, we're back. Now you gotta, you gotta pay up, Mr. Man. Excellent work! A hero and his faithful companion retrieving the ancient artifact for the prince. It's almost... storybook. Ah, oh, but it almost seems a shame to give a weapon like that away, doesn't it? I suppose I could be persuaded to let you keep it. I'm not interested in But the axe. only if you use the axe to kill Barbus. Simple as that. Not interested in it. No oh deal. Huh. I don't no fucking like Barbus, but I also don't like you. I'll have to make my own fun elsewhere. And with the pup back, I'll be restored to my full power. There's a whole world just waiting for me! Yep. I knew I could trust you. You're welcome, Barbus. Yeah, yeah, dog gets master, master gets cosmic axe. Everyone's happy. Just get over here, mutt. Don't worry, I'll make sure he sees the light. I trusted you, now you trust me. So much better. You forget how nice supreme power feels until you've been stuck in a cave for a few years. It's a shame you wished for something so dull as me taking back the mutt. Quite the lack of imagination on your part. A lack of ambition like that really ought to be punished. Perhaps by turning you into a worm. Or maybe a few decades of... Oh, fine. Have my bone and be done with it. Got more interesting deals to make anyway. Ready. We've already collected three Daedric artifacts, and it's like our third day in Skyrim. Let's get out here real quick, and I'll examine the Mask of Clavicus Vile. Yeah, okay. That is indeed a fucking bloody human torso. Skeletal form. How interesting. How how quirky. Alrighty. Harold. Mask of Clavicus Vile. Prices are 20% better. Increases speech by 10 points and Magicka regenerates 5 points faster. Let's see how we look in it. <laughs> Pretty fucking terrifying, as to be expected. But it's it's a it is a cool coolio mask. Indeed. Alrighty. Well, let's get back to Falkreath. We got some more stuff I want to deal with around here. Specifically relating to white caps and growing a fucking giant mushroom tower. Mm. Do I even have white? Oh wait, they'd be in here. Am 
White caps. Still need six of them. I don't know where I could find white caps even. Probably in caves. But I don't know. my horse here? Okay, there. <laughs> there she is. I didn't think I fucking, uh... I, I, th I thought I lost her for a second. You know what we should do? We should investigate what's going on here. We've also got some more shit. Letters in Windhelm. Find the entrance to the Dwarven Ruin. Where even is that? Oh, it's actually not too far away. Then there's a Dawn Guard, of course. Silver Drift Mine. And then find that person's uncle and gather more information. And then I've got. various. um. fucking miscellaneous shits to do. Bile Gulch, I think, is for the, uh, man. Baldir's hunting party? I don't even fucking know what that is. I've completely forgotten some things. Anyway, I guess I could get it marked and see what it is. Baldur's hunting party. I guess it's on the way then. Alright. that I thought were hunters. Hey, there's the troll again.
I forgot that those rocks just <laughs> do damage. I guess it's just a fucking like a... I don't know, like a, a damage strip attached to them or whatever. Whenever you touch those rocks and they move at all, you take damage. It's very, very annoying. Hey there, how's it going? Fucking Thalmor. Falkreath is really just like tucked in down here, isn't it? Amidst this entire like little grove that surrounds it. Oh, those baby horses? I didn't even know those fucking existed. Those are definitely not a base game thing. I would have known about baby horses if they were a base game thing. Oh god, that's a bear. I say just a fucking bear right there. Hold on. Let's try and uh, avoid that. Just a whole ass bear in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, let's get over like. Oh god, there's a sprig in there. No, stop! I wanted you to stop a long time ago. Okay. I was pressing the wrong button to stop, I've just realized that. Oh Jesus. We need healing. Alright, we need to heal that injury up. No, 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 I don't want you coming after me. Fuck, 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 fuck. I'm severely messed up. Feeling this is about to end very badly for me. Yeah, it did. <laughs> Spoiler alert, it did. Oh god. I do not want to deal with all of this right now. It's all because of a little mistake that I made.
to go back down here and see if we can't deal with these bitches. Okay, alright, we need to fuck on healing right now. God damn. <laughs> Get the fuck out of there. Where's my horse at? Makora? Where the fuck's my horse at? Shit. Where is my horse at is a good question. And the truth is, I have no idea, so I'm just gonna fucking leave it. It'll come to me eventually anyway. Probably. Hopefully. Besides, we probably need to get out on our legs more. We've been using horses a lot recently. I don't feel too good about that little scene right there. Why was this dark elf killed? That's strange. I'm, uh, I don't like those Thalmor there, but I can't just fucking attack him. Probably die. For you, stranger. I'd almost given up hope of walking away from here. Who are you? My name's Valder. I hunt out of Falkreath. We tracked a bear to this den. Good coin for those pelts. We had the big sow cornered when they showed up. Three of them, out of nowhere. Spriggins. Niels went down before mm. we even knew to run. Ari died just inside. I never even thought that was real. I may have lost a drop or two of blood. Truth is... I'm not going anywhere like this. Ah, hurts to breathe. I know a spell that would work. Thank you. Please hurry. I suppose wild killer? Oh, we got him. I may have lost a drop or two of blood. Tooth. Thank you. Please hurry. What spells are talking about? Wild healing? Why do I not have healing hands? I may have lost a drop All or right, two of I'm blood. I'm just to give him a potion. I just need a <sighs> much better. Thanks, friend. I wouldn't have lasted much longer without that. But now what? I can't just walk away. Not with my friend's bodies in there being torn apart by those beasts. Well, let me you help do you. that for a stranger? I don't know what to say. Lead on, I suppose. Moss Mother Cavern. Who knows? There might be some funnies in here. Some white caps.
entice barter. Should've never done. I like that a lot. That means I can exploit. Um, uh, some of the more uh, calm related things. Send a wraith to kill them. Then I want to start doing that. And I hate it when they do that. You can't beat me. White caps? <gasps> White caps. That's the mirror's rock. A white cap in here though. It's an imp stool. There might be more. Weakened it even further. This, this dude, Valdir, was doing more than the fucking the clan fear and the bear. Brigands are a lot weaker than I originally suspected. Oh shit. That one's called a Spriggan Matron though. That one does not look fun.
she's going down though. Did she die to the bear trap? I think she did. That's great. It's done then. Justice, if you can call it that. Look, I want you to have this. I know it isn't much, but it's important to me. Ari gave me this dagger when we first started hunting together. I always said it brought her luck. You should be the one to carry it now. Are we good? Are we... I'll give them a proper burial, then come back. Come find me if you're ever in Falkreath. You'll always be welcome at my door. Okay. Let's weapon Baldir's lucky dagger. Oh, one of the worst, uh, one of the worst rare unique items in the game, actually. <laughs> I completely forgot that this is the place where you acquire it. It sounds good on paper, a 25% chance to crit, until you realize that only applies to the base damage. And the base damage is 2.5, so no matter how much you fucking enchant this thing, it will always be a pretty shitty dagger. Not necessarily for the earlier stages, but like, when you get up there, it's gonna be worse and worse. I guess we're going out to clear these bandits for the Yarl of Falkry. Let's calm that dude down. I remember specifically that these bandits are the ones we need to kill for the Yarl of Falkry in order to win his favor. Run off caverns. We'll be there eventually. I love all the little locations that have been added by um, divine villages. They're going to be fun to explore. Okay. Well, I sure do love it when that happens. We might get stuck in a death loop here, and if we do, it's entirely my fault. Nope, we won't. Okay. Oh god. Oh Jesus. What the fuck was that? Oh, it's my clan fear. Actually, I have that funny thing. Neverworld. Yeah, he's still calm. Oh, 
Wow, that's actually really cool. It's a Lost Argonian maid inside of a inside of an outhouse. How interesting. Fucking like that uh, never world ability. There's unfortunately only one white cap in that cave, wasn't there? I don't think I saw any more. God, I'm too fucking rich. I need to blow all my money on some like shitty things. I want to feel like I'm poor and destitute. Like I realistically should be. Being a Dunmer in Skyrim. <laughs> this is not a place where, where a very prosperous Dunmer like to go.
Oh no! Why? Why does it do this? It goes way too fast. I just tried to go down one and went all the way down the mods. Jesus fucking Christ. I hate it when it does this. It's actually the worst. back and you're very quiet oh shit um all right uh settings audio let's bring music down then careful yeah, i meant to save is what i was trying to do <laughs> okay now I'm good. I was sort of testing how far I could go there. So I guess that's around when 30 seconds ends. Alright, so I'm just gonna cast it on him again. <laughs> Theoretically, that resets it. I think it has worked. Alrighty. Do I get to loot him? I do get to loot him. Pretty rags. What the fuck would be the uh, value of those? <laughs> I'm looking to hopefully increase it to 26 so I can get some cool perks. I don't see any white cap down there. Oh yeah, I forgot that I just sort of told that guy to fuck off. Let's use the exploit on him. <laughs> it's not really an exploit, but still. Sort of thing, I'll do it to this one guy. And then we'll probably pull off. slip down the mods. Oh, I'm so angry. And there's no way to fucking exit out of it either. Once you're here, you just gotta wait for them all to load. Or something wrong with this controller, but still.
Why do I still hear combat music? Am I gonna need to turn the music all the way down again? I had to do that last episode because it kept fucking annoying me. Oh shit! I don't know if I want... Yeah, I'll take Pandemonium. Oh wait, I gotta... Oh, why didn't I get another skill point? That should've been another... I think even levels are the double skill- okay, there we go. Uh, even levels are the double skill point levels. Okay, I think the combat music has stopped, thankfully, but here's another. There are so many trolls down in this area. I do not remember this many trolls being in Skyrim. But you can feel free to correct me on that. Because it has been many years since I've played Skyrim. Actually decided to sit down and play it. I've fucked around in Skyrim plenty, but I've never really decided to just sit down and play through the game in at least three years now. Yeah, it's been that long. Let's leave those guys alone. I played Skyrim once and I got uh, bored because of how little color there is. I understand that. Oh shit, this is the Spriggan place. Hey, there's an root here. Alright, shit, I've already missed. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna go back to sleep soon because I'm tired. I understand that. I'm really tired right now for some reason as well. After the stream, I'm probably gonna go and like relax in the hot tub or something. You, sir, you need to shut your mouth. Okay. Is there a person there? I swear to god I just saw a person there. Let's make a wide berth around the Spriggans this time. There's a lot of them down in Falkreath hold. But just to be expected. Hey, it's prayer time. Prayer and worship. Alright, am I praying? I say I was praying. Didn't didn't give me any prayer bonus. Okay, there we go. Mushroom Grove. Interested in seeing what exactly is causing their enhanced growth in this area. Today I'll be heading out to see what kind of effect the mushrooms have. The mushrooms in nearby Nurnroot are having on the ecosystem downstream. That's interesting. There are mushrooms growing around here.
I didn't see any mushrooms. But I sure hope he wasn't lying. Hey, there's mud crabs here. Because if there are mushrooms, that means there's white caps. There's the alchemist down there from earlier. We saw him. I don't see mushrooms, though. I said there were mushrooms here. around for some mushrooms while those two are calmed. I'm still not seeing any. finish up this quest and then sleep and I think we're pretty much gonna round out this episode cuz yeah um, I'm feeling tired and we've done a lot already if you combine that first 40 minutes from Thursday that I recorded Good to see you. I've killed the leader of the bandits. Teach them to stop paying me. Here, you deserve a reward for your service. You know what? I want like thousand you. gold. You're not afraid to get your hands dirty. I hereby grant you permission to purchase property in Falkreath Hold. Talk to my steward if you're interested. Okay. Farewell. That spell looks dangerous. Keep your distance. Who's the steward around here? Is it you? I'm the steward here. I serve under Jarl Sidgir and Jarl Dengir before him. It was Dengir who made me a steward, long ago when he was young. Interesting. When Dengir's health began to fail, Young Sidgear was appointed Jarl in his stead. It was simpler just to keep me as steward. Sidgear has no interest in running his hold, and so leaves such matters to me. As for my part, I do my best to see that folk are treated fairly. There's no house available, but I could sell you a fine piece of land where you could build your own house. I'm suddenly less interested. 5,000 gold? Yeah, I'll have to think about it. Alrighty, um, yeah, so thank you guys for tuning in, uh, thanks everyone in chat for hanging out and having a good time, um, I will upload this tomorrow, um, hopefully you guys all have a nice night, uh, thank you guys on YouTube for watching till the end.
just go here real quick. Yeah, um, thank you all for tuning in, guys. Uh, it's been a great time, and I hope to see you all in the future. If this would load, please. <laughs> Please. Okay, there we go. We see the smoke coming, which means we're loading in. Nope. Give it a second here. Come on in. Just okay. Stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the call though. Hmm. Ready. Let's go here and Okay, seven hours is good enough. Why is it getting so slow all of a sudden? Here, let's just wait another hour. God, this is, it's really slow, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Yeah, uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, it's been a great time.